peaking at 1600 meters. The giant mountains, or Karkonosha, aren't actually all that giant, but they're a picturesque mountain range and a national park located in the north of the Czech Republic and the southwest of Poland. They're very easy to get to from Wrocław Airport, which is only 2.5 hours away, and some of the most popular resort towns include Szklarska Poremba and Harrachov, where many hiking trails begin. This video documents my 20km hike, starting in the Czech Republic and finishing in Poland. This episode is for nature and hiking lovers and won't feature any background music at all, but just the sounds of nature, with a little bit of my commentary. So today I'm hiking on the Czech Republic side. There are beautiful trails going all the way to Poland. And, and it seems like this trail is just a waterfall trail. This is so beautiful. And it's so serene. There's nobody here. What I find fascinating about being here at the end of May is that clearly spring is only just arriving now. If you look at the little buds just opening now, it's beautiful. Beautiful trail, even though this one is actually leading you on asphalt, but it's a nice relief after a few days of walking on very uneven terrain it's beautiful here as well beautiful forests and i think being out here on your own is what i just look forward to the most it's beautiful I love these places. These are little mountain huts, mountain shelters, where you can, I guess, hide from the storms and things. It's just beautiful. And again, it's fantastic to be here on your own. Love it. And this is my trail towards Visotska Boda, which is a mountain shelter and like a hotel and sort of a restaurant as well and a rest point. It's beautiful here. The forest of the Czech Republic. So I basically came from there. I'm just pointing at like, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, an old gigantic ski jump and all the way up to Polska Polka and then over to the Polish side where I'm sure it's going to be quite a sharp turn down
this is on top of Shrenica. Uh, and what we found just now is uh, a granite formation called Three Piggies. Three Piggies. Polish side towards the mountain shelter here under Blavski Szczyt. I still can't see it, but it's coming up soon. This is Szrenica and these are all Polish Kakusze. This really must have been my favorite trail of all. Uh, the green trail from the Mokra Przełęcz, wet pass, down to the mountain shelter under Wapski Peak. It's just so beautiful and quiet. And have a look at all these views. So we've got Srenica still there. And you can see the, uh, the little um, cable car. There's plenty of ski uh, routes there, pistes, as they say. I need to really dust off my skiing vocabulary. And yeah, and this is where we enter the forest. Because here, you go into the forest quite quickly, actually. Uh, these, mount these mountains aren't very high, they're not as high as the Tatras, so you don't have a whole lot of uh, altitude. And then you just basically enter forests and it's still beautiful. This is the Wapski Peak mountain shelter and the Wapski summit peak just over there. This is a beautiful way, beautiful trail. One of my favorites, I have to say so far. This trail leads all the way up to the mountain shelter at the Wapski Peak, as you can see just up there. And in the winter, as you can see, this actually uh, serves as a mountain piste, skiing piste. You can see those poles sticking out. You might be thinking, why are they here? Well, this is because sometimes there is so much snowfall that you wouldn't be able to see the actual piste. And these poles basically indicate to the skiers, all oh, right, okay, so this is where I'm supposed to go. Because uh, luckily, hopefully, they would be sticking out, out of the snow cover still. But yeah, this is a beautiful view. Wapski Peak and massive over there and I'm heading down now towards Szklarska Poremba. I also love the fact that you can see a lot of these stone formations, rock formations here, there in the distance. They come from the last ice age and some of them are made of granite. Most of them are made of granite. something strangely calming about just watching this. 
empty cable car. Love it. These rocks are something else. Beautiful. This is one of the most beautiful things I've seen. These trees are absolutely vertical and they seem to grow out of nothing more than rocks. They obviously don't grow out of rocks, but if you look at this one here, just a moment, I mean, how genius is this? These trees as tall as this just stand vertically practically well perfectly vertically upon rocks just like these ones as well what a beautiful view amazing this is interesting so according to this stone this is the beginning, the origin of Szklarska Poremba, 1366. And it's just mounted here in front of this church.